Lucas was on the rise in his career. He was able to gather a huge fandom in a short time, but then he got involved in controversy that made him go on hiatus for two years. Here is what happened. Lucas was born as Wong yak -hei on January 25, 1999 in Sha Tin, Hong Kong, to a Chinese father with Tia Chu ancestry and a Thai mother. Lucas helped run a Thai restaurant in Hong Kong owned by his parents. He visited Thailand often, at least once a year, to rest and visit his mother's family. Lucas was picked up by SM Entertainment in late 2015 after succeeding in a global edition in Hong Kong. As an SM trainee, Lucas received training in modeling before switching to idol preparations and learning singing, rapping, and dancing. In 2017, he was introduced as a member of SM Rookies, a pre-debut training team of young trainees. The same year, Lucas made an appearance in NCT member 10's Dream in a Dream music video. Lucas, whose native language is Cantonese, studied Korean and Mandarin in preparation for his debut. In January 2018, SM Entertainment unveiled NCT 2018, a project group for the expansive boy group NCT. Lucas, together with Kuen and Young Wu, were the group's newest members. Lucas officially made his debut with NCT on March 14 with their debut studio album NCT 2018 Empathy. Lucas recorded three songs for the album as part of the subunit NCTU, including title tracks Boss, Yesterday, and Black on Black as NCT. For the promotions, he appeared on variety shows, which introduced his personality to a wider audience. His funny personality made people be a fan of him. In December 2018, Lucas was announced as part of NCT's China-based unit Wavy, managed by SM Entertainment subsidiary label V. The seven-member unit officially debuted on January 17, 2019 with their debut single album The Vision. Its lead single Regular On August 7, 2019, Lucas was announced as a member of Super M, a K-pop supergroup created by SM Entertainment in collaboration with Capitol Records. The group's promotions began in October, aimed at the American market. Super M's self-titled debut EP was released on October 4, 2019 with lead single Jopping. In October 2020, Lucas returned to perform with NCT for the first time since Black on Black in 2018 for the second group-wide project, NCT 2020, featuring all 23 members. He participated in the album Resonance PT1 on the songs Make a Wish, Birthday Song, and few others. On March 10, 2021, Wavy released their third EP, Kick Back, with the lead single of the same name. The album became the group's first number one album on JN Album Chart. On August 25, 2021, Lucas was scheduled to release the single Jalapeno alongside fellow Wavy member Hendry. However, following controversy arising from his alleged past relationships, SM Entertainment and Label V announced that the release, as well as its promotions, had been postponed. On August 23, 2021, a Twitter user started to share her past relationship with Lucas. I'm a fan that dated NCT and Wavy's Lucas, and I'm about to expose that he's a Chinese man that is cheap. At first, he expressed interest in me and got my number. We started dating like that but he asked to break up suddenly because he was having a hard time due to schedules. So we broke up without any negative feelings. But that's where the problems all started. The fan claimed that after they broke up, Lucas would still ask to see her. He allegedly would visit her on his rest days at hotels or her house and asked her to pay for everything. She claimed that while they were dating, he would ask her to pay for everything, including cigarettes. He allegedly claimed that he could not use his card because he didn't want to get caught out as a celebrity. She also claimed she would give him luxury items while he would send pictures of hotels he wanted to visit, and he'd ask her to book them. She also claimed that he said not to buy him gifts unless they were cars or houses, even when he was starting to earn money as well. He gaslit me by saying that there was no one else who was able to understand him. Every time, he only came to the hotel, ate room service, slept, and left. 
The moment we checked out, he cut off contact and drew the line with me by saying it was uncomfortable. Without a single thanks, he acted as if it was a given that I should pay. On August 25, SM and Lucas released statements regarding this issue. SM said, He has recognized the seriousness of the matter and decided to halt the release of all contents including the planned upcoming single, Jalapeno as part of the Wavy unit with Hendry, that was supposed to be launched at 6 p.m. on August 25. Lucas is deeply reflecting on having caused great hurt and disappointment through his own wrong actions and our company also takes responsibility for not having managed our artist better. Lucas said, This is Lucas Wong Yuk Hei. I sincerely apologize to those who've been hurt due to my misactions. Please give me an opportunity to apologize. I'm very sorry. Also, I sincerely apologize to my fans who have always been supporting me and caring for me. Sorry for letting you all down I in the past few days, I've deeply reflected on the things that I've done in the past. I have clearly realized that my mistakes and irresponsible behavior have let my fans, who have always cheered me on and supported me, down. Once again, I sincerely apologize to those who feels disappointed by my actions. I guarantee this will never happen again, and I'll halt my activities for the next while in order to deeply reflect on my actions. Lastly, I want to apologize to my members, company staff, business partners, and TV show staff for causing inconvenience to everyone with my actions. I'm very sorry. More people came forward saying that he treated them the same and accused him of cheating. According to the former fans, Lucas approached fans and slept with them, asked for expensive gifts, and lied to each of them, saying they were the only person he was dating at the time. One netizen claimed they visited him at home, and he invited them to smoke and drink. When they began chatting, he allegedly discussed his fellow members, calling them disobedient, lazy, and difficult to guide. As a proof, one of them shared a photo of Lucas sleeping. His so-called ex-girlfriends kept on sharing more details, painting Lucas as the worst human being. Korean netizens were angry about the situation and started to trend hashtag Lucas out on Twitter, demanding that Lucas leave NCT and Wavy. Then fans found out that Lucas was removed from the new NCT merchandise. His fans did not believe those women, they thought it was all fabricated, photoshopped. And there are some fans that say they will love him no matter what, even though he would be quilty. He did create a huge, strong fan base in a short time, so in this situation, fans are helping him to get back on his feet. With time, he started to post on Instagram and the NCT main account followed all the members, even Lucas. People took it as Lucas would come back in the next comeback with one of the subunits. Then, fans hopes were raised once again as Lucas makes his appearance in Welcome to NCT Universe, albeit as a cameo. Episode 9 of the show saw the SM rookies being shown all the members in their rookie years. To everyone's surprise, the montage included all seven Wavy members. On May 10th of this year, SM Entertainment officially announced the departure of member Lucas from NCT and Wavy. It was a shock to everyone as SM kept teasing Lucas' comeback. SM said, as a result of a serious discussion between Lucas and the agency, it has been decided that Lucas will leave NCT and Wavy and instead pursue solo activities. The decision was reached based on the belief that it was the best option to respect the other members and the fans, and thus, we ask for the understanding of all fans who have supported Lucas as a member of NCT and Wavy. Then Lucas came up with his statement. After much deliberation and reflection, I have made the difficult decision to part ways with the group NCT and Wavy. I sincerely feel sorry for the members, and it is with a heavy heart that I leave behind a long-standing friendship. It has been nearly eight years since I first joined the members, and I am deeply grateful for their care and support. I will cherish these memories and never forget. I hope that the members will remember me as Huang Shishi, not just Lucas. I genuinely love them and will always support them from the bottom of my heart. 
It took considerable time for me to reach this decision, and I believe this is the right decision for the good of all. Then it was announced that Lucas will open his account in Bubble to connect with his fans. His fans were really happy as of a step ahead for his upcoming solo debut. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any of our upcoming K-drama, K-pop content. Thanks for tuning in.